Hey guys, it's Andy here. I wanted to do a quick webcam video. Um, went through several takes, and most of them have been at least you know 10 plus minutes long. So I'm gonna try to make this as quick as I can. So apologies if I talk a mile a minute. Um, as you guys know, I started uh, C school recently, so my uploading schedule is a little wonky at the moment. But I'm gonna be try. I'm gonna be trying to upload stuff at least once a week. And on that note, if you guys uh, were around last weekend, I released a uh, demo track for my upcoming EP, Tentacle Difficulties. Now, um, as you guys know, I come up with a lot of riff ideas, but I've never really come up with any song ideas. Never actually structured, you know, full songs before. So this EP is more or less a learning process for me. I don't really expect it to be the greatest album ever, or have the best sound quality, or the best playing, or... You know, I don't expect any of that. I mean, if you guys like it, you know, that's awesome, and I appreciate it. But this is more or less just a learning experience, you know, learning to write songs, learning to write lyrics, you know, melodies, riffs, um, how to mix it, and uh, just bring it all together, basically. So this is like a little project I'm doing. Now, hopefully, you know, subsequent EPs will be, you know, better quality and stuff, but... This one is more or less, you know, just a learning process. So, yeah, I don't really have a an actual like, you know, completion date for set for it yet because it's a very new project, and uh, I've only released, you know, just a quick down and dirty demo of the first track. Uh, but I do have uh, some song ideas for, just basically song concepts, I guess for at least five to seven songs and a bonus track recently so yeah I'm gonna try to upload at least one rough track uh, a week and then just progressively clean it up and add like bass lines and drum lines and drum lines are gonna be for me the most difficult cuz I'm not really excuse me, I'm not really good with the uh, drum programming that's once again you know a learning process so yeah, I'm also going to uh, distribute it online. There's not going to be any physical copies. At least I don't think there will be as of today. So I expect to just distribute it online through like uh, iTunes, Reverb Nation, SoundCloud, that sort of thing. So uh, if you guys are familiar with uh, those kind of programs, those kind of sites, uh, definitely leave something in the comments as far as. Uh, which one you would recommend that I use for distributing my music and uh, I'll look into it. So, Also, um, with that being said, I'm also going to be uh, doing a juice fast. I'm gonna start doing that at the end of Labor Day weekend. And uh, the reason for it is, uh, you know, mostly to lose weight because you know, I got a PRT coming up which is a physical readiness test and I uh, definitely need to lose a couple LBs if uh, the YouTube comments are to be taken seriously <laughs> but in all seriousness though I, I do need to lose some weight and uh, I'm hoping that the juice fast will uh, help me in that and it's not just to lose weight but it's also to just basically feel healthier because I mean I gotta be honest I I don't really like my eating habits now granted I've gotten better over the past couple weeks but still it's not quite up to what I want it to be so I'm hoping that uh, you know this new juice fast will kinda wipe the slate clean so I can you know, begin incorporating healthier stuff into my diet, you know, more lean meats as opposed to greasy red meat and, you know, burgers and fries and burritos and pizza and all this other stuff. You know, I'm hoping to, you know, just steer away from that because as much as I love it, and I do love it to some extent, but it, it's more like a, it's more lust than love. It's not really a you know, I really love this. It's more like a, I need it. I crave it. You know, I gotta have it. <laughs> that sort of thing. So I want to detach myself from my attachment to food, if that makes any sense. And uh, that's kind of where I'm going with this uh, juice fast. Basically, just to kind of wipe the slate clean. And I'm not really sure how long I'm gonna do the juice fast, cause you know I'm still 
pretty new at this, so I'm going to be looking up, uh, over the Labor Day weekend, I'm going to be looking up uh, different juicing machines and different uh, recipes and things like that. And as far as like juicing machines go, I want to get something that's very simple. I'm not looking for like super top of the line, can, you know, juice and make smoothies and do your taxes and all this other stuff. You know, I'm just looking for something very simple, very small, hopefully, because I don't really have a lot of space in my closet to store stuff. And, you know, something that's very easy to clean because, you know, like I said, space, space issues and, you know, I'm a guide, you know gotta do stuff. <laughs> Always doing stuff. So, yeah, that's gonna be happening as well. So, uh, there's definitely a lot to look forward to. And also, for Labor Day weekend, uh, Sam and I are planning on renting a car and going around San Diego, all the different spots that we can't normally get to because we mostly take the trolley and the bus and things like that. So, and I think it'll be nice to have a car for the first time in over a year. You know, just the freedom of being able to get in and go wherever the heck you want. You know, you don't have to check the bus schedule or freak out because, you know, the bus stopped running at this amount of time. It's like, oh crap, I gotta get a hotel. and You know, this, that, and the other. So, we're gonna be doing that, you know, just for maybe like two or three days. Just, you know, touring around. We might even go a little outside San Diego just to see what's all out there, you know, go to some nice, you know, scenery, things like that. So there's definitely some possible life in videos that's going to be recorded. And I also told Sam that I want to do, definitely, definitely do a life in video in uh, on Convoy Street, which I mentioned in one of my other videos as being basically San Diego's Asian town. Although it's... It's more Korean based, but there are a lot of other Asian cultures there too. There's a lot of Japanese, Chinese, there's some Thai in there. It's, you know, it's kind of our, you know, Asian town, I guess. You know, San Francisco has Chinatown, we have Convoy Street. And there's definitely a lot of great places, great restaurants. Um, gotta recommend the kimchi at pretty much every, anywhere. <laughs> I haven't had a bad piece of kimchi yet from any of those places, so yeah, I'm definitely going to be showing you guys that, uh, showing you bookstores, oh my god, Sam found this bookstore, and you know, as long as I can take cameras in there, I gotta show you it, it's, it's amazing, it, it, it's going to be amazing, so definitely look forward to all that stuff, look forward to my ten Tentacle Difficulties EP coming out soon, I guess. I'm going to try to work on, you know, a rough cut of one track a week, and then as the weeks go on, add more layers to it, and things like that. And I'm also toying with the idea of having uh, guest musicians as well, because, like I said, you know, I'm only one guy, and it would be really nice to get the YouTube community involved. And I got my eye on a couple musicians out there. Definitely want to, you know, do a collab with. Um, mostly guitar players, you know, I gotta admit, but I'm also gonna try to get some other people who are non-guitar players, and maybe some singers, bass players, drummers, <laughs> I really hope I get some drummers, because, like I said, I'm not really good with the drum programming, so definitely be best if I worked with, you know, a live drummer, you know, real, you know, <laughs> a real drummer, basically. Um, and also, uh, Maybe some different instruments would be nice too. I'm interested in a lot of different kinds of instruments, um, like a hammered dulcimer. I really like the sound of that, but eh, that's just me. I'm weird. <laughs> but anyway, hopefully this video isn't too long. I'm trying to shoot for under 10 minutes, so let's find out if I made my goal. So yeah, this is the Andy San signing off for now. Thanking you guys for tuning in to my hopefully quick video. And for rating, commenting, subscribing, sending a few friends to the party. See you guys back there. Thanks. And, uh, yeah, thanks for all the support. Feel free to leave stuff in the comments. And as always, we'll see you next time. Night, guys.